Now we have studied that evolution helps us survive better. It helps in the process of, of uh, <clears throat> surviving a changing environment, surviving harsh conditions which are erupting and whatnot. So in this regard, the way we have been studying evolution, it might you know, strike our mind that evolution is basically a form of biological progress, right? It may seem that evolution is the best way to define biological progress and biological growth. So the development, the progress is immense and evolution is just a wonderful, wonderful progress. No. Evolution is not the same as progress. Just understand. That's what we're going to do in this video. Evolution and progress. Evolution and progress are not the same thing. Why? Well, evolution may help organisms survive a changing environment and survive uh, better. However, we cannot say that those organisms who have evolved better are the ones which are going to survive forever. They have evolved, they have like progressed in life and the ones which are less evolved, they're not going to survive, they're going to perish. That's not, that's not what, what's going to happen. Although Darwin's theory, you know, misguides our mind to believe that. It's not that evolution and progress are the same thing. He doesn't mean to say that in a sense. He says that they survive in a changing environment better. But... Progress and evolution are not the same thing. Let's, let's try to understand that. Evolution basically results in organisms with better characteristics. Right? They have better characteristics to survive a changing environment. That's it. That's all. Right? But it does not mean that their origin origin the organism origin organism it does not mean that this organism will perish it will not perish it's not going to perish it still has its characteristics present so we're not saying that you know we are transiting from one form of characteristics to another it's not like that that's what we call progress that's what that would be progress but we are not you know drifting from one group of characteristics to another it's not like that those original group of characteristics still survive so original characteristics still survive right they are not perishing if they would have perished and it's like a complete shift, then it would be progress. But it's not progress. It just enables organisms to survive in a changing environment because they have better characteristics. It's that they have newer characteristics. But the original characteristics, original organisms with original characteristics still survive, right? Hence, you cannot say that evolution is progress. No, evolution is not progress. If you get a question why, then you can explain that now because Evolution basically is just the introduction of newer characteristics in organisms due to natural selection, due to change over generations and generations, due to natural selection, genetic drift, etc. But it's not that that evolution enables organisms which are less evolved, which have older characteristics. It doesn't mean that evolution will perish them. No, they are not changing. Not all of them are changing. Only some of them are getting some particular characteristics, right? So it's not exactly progress, right? It's just a form of you know, newer introduction of newer characteristics into the biological sphere and gene pool. So I hope you're clear with the fact that evolution is not the same as progress. Thank you very much. So in the next video, we'll culminate this chapter with the last uh, point, last topic, human evolution. Thank you. Goodbye. Stay healthy. Stay smart.